Cynthia Robbins in Orange County, living in the OC. I'm an interior designer. My son, Damon Robbins, is a realtor. We're interested in working with you to buy, sell, or flip a house. We also work with foreclosures. Today, and we want to get you familiar with Orange County, today we are doing something very fun, very special. This is a little bit of a reminiscent thing for me because I have a son, an older son, who played football at USC and they used to come down to this same campus here at UCI to have their uh, preseason practices. And now the same field is being used by the LA Rams. And we have three tickets to be able to come down here today and watch their preseason practices. So the only thing I would add, hey everyone, I usually do the intro, but we thought we'd let mom handle it today. So it's always <laughs> fun to mix things up. Right. I'm trying to drive too. So anyway, the only thing I would add to what you're saying is that we now are trying to help people with renovation and listing as well. Uh, not just doing fix and flips, but. Yes, if you have a home that was listed and didn't sell, usually it's because it's not 100% upgraded and current. People today, husbands and wives are both working, have families, don't have time to do all the renovating. So we have a program that we will come in and pay for all the renovations to your home and then put it on the market. So we'd like to talk to you about that. So give us a call. Yeah, uh, you know the routine. All of our information is going to be in the uh, little button down below. You should have our contact info, phone number, email. You can set up a Zoom call if you want to talk to us. It gives us, gives you an hour of our time. So you can set that up through the website in that little uh, button there in the right corner. Um, I'm trying to drive and talk here at the same time so we're going right here anyway so yeah this should be a fun exciting day today being able to check out the rams preseason. so last week on our footage we went down to angel stadium had a lot of fun doing that i didn't get my cold beer that i wanted well and the reason we're doing it is we want people to come to orange county to realize look all the fun things you can do and this this campus is uci university of california irvine famous for people in mathematics, science, technology, uh, anything to do with computers. Things that I'm terrible at. Exactly. Yeah. So, <laughs> yes, it's a very hard school, I think, to get into. It is, yeah. Because they have so many math, science geniuses here. So, yeah, anyway, so we, we went down to look at the Angels and we thought, okay, the Rams are in town. It would be a lot of fun. And as mom was mentioning earlier, your other son used to play for the Trojans and they used to have their summer camp down here. So yes. they haven't been down here in what, 25, 30 years, whatever it's been. For on this practice field. But that's uh, sure. the Rams are here and uh, question marks, you know, the, uh, this is just from my perspective. They got to get their offense figured out. Um, they lost some key players after the Super Bowl. Uh, Andrew Whitworth, the uh, Offensive tackle retired, replacing him was huge. But during the Super Bowl game, Odell Beckham Jr. went out with that knee injury and just kind of showed the weaknesses then in the offense because they were able to focus in and double team Cooper Cup at the wideout and really shut them down So um, with the double team. And so they've got to figure out the question marks at the running back position. Is Cam Akers going to be the guy going forward because ever since Todd Gurley left their running uh, game has struggled a bit and everything with their offense has been based on the play action pass so without the running game being a threat teams have been able to focus in on them and shut them down by just shutting Cooper Cup down at the wideout so hold on for one second yeah. yeah okay so what were we talking about we were talking about the offensive attack and then on the other side of the ball they've also lost some key players from the super bowl von miller of course went to the buffalo bills 
and Jalen Ramsey went to the Miami Dolphins. So those were a couple of huge pieces defensively that they lost, but we still have the best defensive player in football and Aaron Donald at the you know, nose tackle, nose uh, defensive lineman. He's rated by, on the Madden game that comes out, he's like the top rated defensive player every year. They give him basically a hundred score, 99 or a hundred score, which is off the charts. So defensively, you know, they have some there are questions on both sides of the ball. So it's going to be fun to watch. This is kind of fun. We get to take our subscribers with us to all the fun things that we're doing here in the OC, which is kind of cool. Uh, yeah, and as I mentioned before, we have a lot of other realtors in the area uh, that are putting out content as well. I just thought, I don't want to just put out everything that they're doing uh, and just regurgitating the same stuff. That's why we're trying to, to mix it up and bring some fun footage for you. This is the home of the world famous Ant Eaters. Is that what their mascot yeah, is? Yeah, their mascot. You ever heard of an anteater? It's a well, big, I've it's actually a big... seen one in the zoo. They, they, they're a lot, kind of long, it's a long the snout. The long snout, yeah. yeah. They suck up ants for fun. I need one at my house. Yeah. All right, so we're back. We're heading on into the uh, practice facility here in Melbourne. Been here, but as we were saying earlier, for 25, 30 years. So the whole parking structure is full, so lots of people are lots coming of, today. Wow. Lots of crazy Rams fans are here. Wow. So we're going to check it out. Training camp. To get up to uh, SoFi, for Orange County, it's really not more than an hour depending on traffic. But to get to the new stadium from Orange County, yeah. 45 minutes. Right. And if you haven't been to SoFi yet, they put three to four billion dollars into the stadium. It's pretty unbelievable. This is here at UCI. Claire Trevor School of the Arts, and it's kind of a deja vu thing for me because I went to dental school originally at USC, and uh, Claire Trevor was a patient there at the office where I worked, and her husband was Milton Bren, Don Bren, who developed all of Mission Viejo, is their son, and, uh, and Claire starred with John Wayne in the movie Stagecoach way back when, I guess in the 30s probably. A uh, very sweet lady, wonderful person. And obviously they've now donated money here. And this is the Bren Center that we're going to go through here to get in. We're doing loops. You think you're in Disneyland, doing loops back and forth like a snake to get into the uh, center here. So we can see the practice. It starts in about, I don't know, half an hour. So we just had about a 45 minute, almost an hour little delay trying to get in here. I had no idea it was going to be this crowded. Weaving back and forth inside the parking structures, up and down different levels. Now I think we're finally where they're going to check our bags, make sure we don't have any stuff we shouldn't have. To go through the metal detectors and all of that. So we made it finally. shot you're going to get him even my hat off today so enjoy it. The hat will be back on in a second. Repping the Rams. Got the royal blue going. You notice the kicks? Boom. Get a picture of these. <laughs> Oh, 
nice beer koozie to keep your your corona all your corona products nice and fresh and cold so we're going to slide this in here i don't want to say i promote corona all the time but it's probably one of my favorite beers to drink and i've been talking about having a cold sip of beer for about two videos now so here it goes that is refreshing 
some football, huh? Thank 
little a little breeze, which is nice. It's even though it's the, the end of July. Nice little breeze coming through, not too hot. It's perfect. And a perfect time to enjoy a Corona premiere. Right. Georgia? Yep. We're watching Stetson Bennett right here, number, number 13. 13. Had a pretty uh, interesting collegiate career. It was a walk on at Georgia, but it, it's more complicated than that. He uh, wasn't getting enough he, reps. He, he, I heard he was at a, on the JC level, went back down to a junior college. Played a season or two there to uh, his numbers, his numbers up. So he's actually like 30 years old by now as, as, a, as a rookie. No, I'm, I'm kidding. Like he's 25. I think he's like 25 or 26 as a rookie. And he played, started when um, then he came back the, former, the former SC quarterback, JT Daniels, we call him John Daniels, uh, was the starter and got himself heard about, I don't know, four or five games into the season. And uh, so Stetson then got his shot and stepped in and went undefeated with them the rest of the way. And he won two national titles with the Georgia Bulldogs. As a walk-on, started out as so, a walk-on. That's the Cinderella story. Here he is now with the Rams. Very cool. And I, I think he's gonna get some playing time. He's that good. I think, um, He'll end up being the backup, I would say, to uh, Stafford. I don't see Stafford suited up today. Number nine, he's not out there. Number nine, I don't see him. He's out there, he's just not Is he? Oh, okay. Yeah, he's straight ahead. He's, he's got his hand on backwards, so just follow the... Uh, you see where number 11 is? Look, look to the left, he's got his hands on, on his, his hips. On his hips? Yeah, okay, that's Stafford right there. What's he sweating for out there? Hey, man, he's, he's coaching. He's, he's got an ego, right? Yeah, right. Yeah. Okay. A lot of testosterone out there. That's right. We're going at each other right here. We're hitting each other. They're, you know, they're not going in low. But they're, they're making contact. We're just hitting each other. See, the thing is, like, a lot of these guys are fighting for their jobs. Because, Chan, how many uh, roster spots are there again? 56, I think? 53. 53. So, a lot of these guys are playing just to make the team.
2023. Got some good footage. Hopefully we're going to take a look at it when we get back. We'll get home. We'll yeah. take a look and see how fun. We just want you to know it's one of the many things that you can do in Orange County. We have lots of extra things that we're going to do in the future to show you. We would like to have you call us, come see us, meet us. We'll take you and show you around. So we'll see you next week. Yeah, so you guys know the routine at this point. Uh, uh, hit the subscribe button if you haven't done so already. Hit the bell for notifications. All of our contact information is below. Shoot us a text, send us an email. Give us a surprise. Send up a Zoom call. However you want to get in touch with us, you can. We're here for you. We're looking to move to nine days or 90. We've got you covered making that smooth move and transition to Orange County. So it's Damon and Cynthia. With the coolest mother son of little I know. Absolutely. Do a little self promotion. I uh, just want to thank you guys though, too. We're up to 56,000 subscribers now as of today when I looked. Uh, so, and shoot us questions. Yeah. We, we really are trying hard to make sure that we answer your questions. Whether you're in pre foreclosure, you're buying, you're selling, you want to have renovation of your house to get it ready to sell, we can help you with that. We can pay for that. You don't have to have a penny out of your own pocket. Lots of things to talk about. Right. Exactly. Yeah. So we'll see. We've got lots of options for you, is the point. Yes. Yeah. And as we talked about uh, with our friend Wolf up in LA the other day, we have a huge network. So if we can't help you, we know people that can. Absolutely. So don't hesitate to reach out to us. It's worth the phone call. And my phone number is probably going to be all over. Uh, well, no, not on this one. Yet. We'll make we'll sure that it. you get it. We'll see you. Uh, no, just yeah, all the contact information is down below. All right. We'll see you next week. See you then. God bless. Bye.